find out whether temperatures affect the states of matter. So first, we're going to take our ice cubes out of the freezer. Uh, first, we need to put on our suits. Okay. Always be safe when you're doing science experiments. Containers. The three containers we have is first the hot pot right here. Then we have a room temperature container and then a container that's in the fridge. Let's go get that. Let's turn, this is going to be our room temperature container. And then this is our fridge. So I'm going to take it down to the fridge and can you just turn it, I would say to the 150 watts. So what is the lid for? So um, since the hot pot obviously has heat in it, when the ice melts, since the water when it melts will be hot, the steam will rise up. So when we put the lid on top of the container, you should start seeing steam and also known as gas come up on top of the lid. Hasn't been about yet a minute or two, right? So it's been four minutes since we first put the ice in the hot container. What has happened is all the ice has already melted and the water inside is already coming to a boil. We have put the lid on top of the um, hot container since the steam is starting to rise and the air and gas has gone on top of the lid which has caused more water to just be on the lid. So what is actually happening, we had a solid which turned into liquid and as it is boiled, it is, as it is beginning to boil, it is steaming. It is becoming a gas, right? Can you see the gas? Yeah. Awesome. Still solid, there is just a little bit of water, uh, but it's mostly solid, so nothing much happened in the fridge in those four minutes. So Temperature definitely affects the ice cubes and it depends if it's really hot then it will melt completely but if it's cold and it's still in a cold environment it might as well stay so hmm i have a question for you do you remember the newspaper article that's in the thumbnail yes what was that all about it was about um, instead of us melting ice cubes now, we are using rocks to see if the temperature affects if rocks can still melt. Okay, so what we did is we did the same experiment as with the ice. We put some rocks in three different containers and uh, we'll come find out what happened, okay? Look out for our next episode where Mama Rogers and Milady go for a life science exploration with solids, liquids and gases. And don't forget to click the subscribe button.